Beauregard said you have an identical twin who hasn't been back to Misty Hollow in years. Why were you talking about my family with Beauregard? I was interviewing him, of course. It's how I get all my information. Of course. Anyway, the twin. Yes, yes, Tamara. She lives abroad and I'm quite happy with her being far away from me. Why's that? She's a prima donna, always has to be the center of attention. She was always nagging at me to be more like her. Tabitha, I want you to look good for the picture today. A little more class than usual. Tamara, I am not some wild pony raised by wolves like you make me out to be. I just want us to make a good showing. It's a scholarship in honor of our father, after all. Yes, and he'd want me to be myself. Yesterday didn't turn out too bad. The fly pestering Tamara was a nice touch. Try to keep your composure with that. Ha. Huh. Hey Tabby. Nice picture in the paper. What is the deal with everyone today? Oh, Tabby, it's nothing, but the photo from yesterday in the news, well, it's a little less than flattering. Well, Tamara looks silly. But I'm, reading they mixed up our names. Tamara's the one smashing a fly into her face, not me. Sure, sure. I mean, if I had an identical twin, I would say that, too. But we don't all have the luxury of a built-in scapegoat. Well, have your laughs. I certainly don't care. You know, it is past school hours. You can leave any time. Just saying. Not just yet. What is the status of your relationship with Dr. Collins? Oh my gosh. What do you know about that? Sigh, we're friends. But you were dating, weren't you? That's what my mom said. I mean, she didn't say it to me. But she was talking to her friend Lacey, who is a total blabbermouth by the way, and I just happened to be in the next room and they didn't know. Yes, yes, I get it. I suppose maybe we were dating or something, years ago. Well, what do you think of Dr. Fairfax? No, no, don't go there. I'm not having that conversation with you. So you do have a thing for him. Are you trying to assuage your own insecurities caused by the loss of your father, by cultivating mentoring relationships with stallions of higher education? Don't try to psychoanalyze me. Well, baby Bobbin, did you collect enough information for your report? It'll do. But Dr. Fairfax, if you wouldn't mind answering a couple of questions. You're done for the day. I'm going to need a week of vacation to recover from this.